we are preparing to simultaneously freeze and OCT embed fresh tissue. We add the fresh tissue, materials to make an isopentane and liquid nitrogen bath, OCT at room temperature, a cryo mold for embedding, forceps and spatula, and powdered dry ice that we made with a mortar and pestle. First, we will prepare the isopentane and liquid nitrogen bath. Fill two thirds of a metal beaker with isopentane. Make sure you add enough isopentane to fully submerge the tissue. Place in a doer of liquid nitrogen filled to the same level as the isopentane to allow sufficient contact. Incubate for at least 15 minutes. Next, we will prepare the fresh tissue. Using a rolled up laboratory wipe, absorb excess blood or solution from the surface of the tissue to limit ice crystal formation. Label the cryomold to mark the orientation of the tissue. Make sure you label the cryomold before adding OCT and tissue, as the OCT will quickly turn white once frozen, making it hard to determine tissue orientation later. Now we can OCT embed the fresh tissue. In a Petri dish, carefully coat the fresh tissue sample with room temperature OCT, ensuring there are no bubbles on the surface of the tissue. Using a spatula, place the OCT coated tissue into an appropriately sized cryomold. Fill the cryo mold with additional OCT, ensuring that the tissue is completely covered. Confirm that there are no bubbles, especially near the tissue. Using forceps, lower the cryo mold containing embedded tissue into the isopentane without fully submerging. Keep the cryo mold in contact with the isopentane until the OCT has solidified and turned white. If isopentane and liquid nitrogen are not available, Powdered dry ice or a metal block chilled in dry ice can be used as an alternative. Once frozen, place the cryo mold on powdered dry ice. Remove the tissue block from the cryo mold and trim it using a razor blade. Then, place the OCT embedded tissue block into a pre cooled Wheaton cryo lead cryophile. Alternatively, a resealable bag can be used for storing the tissue block. Failure to use a sealed container for storage may dehydrate and damage the tissue. Store frozen OCT embedded tissue in a sealed container at minus 80 degrees Celsius or liquid nitrogen for long-term storage, or immediately proceed to cryosectioning and section placement. We have frozen and OCT embedded the fresh tissue, and next we will prepare to cryosection.